Hello everyone, welcome to Axum Technology Channel. Today I will explain you what is RFID technology, how it works and what applications it has. But first, I invite you to like this video and subscribe to the channel. What is RFID? RFID stands from Radio Frequency Identification is a wireless technology that uses electromagnetic frequencies to uniquely identify objects. What is the history of RFID? RFID chips first appeared in 1948. Their use was then only military. Their purposes were to differentiate enemy aircraft and calculate their distance. Allied aircraft were also equipped with RFID to emit a friendly signal. This system then called, Identify Friend or Foe, IFF, remains the principle on which air traffic is based. In the 1980s, RFID chips started to get smaller and cheaper. This is the beginning of manufacturing and marketing for European and American companies. The 1990s saw the standardization of the technology. Finally, the giant Walmart democratized the system in 2005 by imposing RFID technology on its largest suppliers for inventory management. So let's see now how does RFID technology works. An RFID system consists of an RFID tag, an RFID reader and an IT framework to collect and manage the data. An RFID tag contain a chip and an antenna. Thanks to its antenna, a reader sends a magnetic or electromagnetic wave. An RFID tag, placed in the field, captures part of the energy to power itself. The reader modulates the electromagnetic field to transmit commands to the tag. Passive RFID technology has several frequencies of use that meet the constraints and needs of the application. Among the choices of frequency, the three most widespread are the low frequency LF, used for animal tracking, livestock and pets. The high frequency HF, used for applications such as ticketing or tracking of rental gears. The ultra-high frequency UHF, also known as RAIN RFID, most often used for inventories. The low frequency RFID system has a lower data transmission capacity, but the reading capacity increases in the proximity of metals or liquids. On the contrary, if a system operates with a higher frequency, the data is transmitted faster and the reading distance is greater, but the radio waves are more sensitive to interference caused by the presence of liquids and metals. UHF RFID allows for blind multiple reading of tags from a distance of up to several meters in a few seconds. UHF is very efficient and suitable for inventory applications. In order to communicate with each other, the reader and the RFID chip must operate on the same frequency. The first most used frequency range is the ultra-high frequency also known as RAIN RFID. The second is NFC, part of HF frequency. This technology available on our smartphones is used in everyday life. An RFID tag can take different forms. Hard tag, label, bracelet, key ring, card, ticket, or even integrated into a material such as concrete, rubber and others. What is RFID used for? There are a multitude of uses such as, linen and clothes identification, monitoring of PPE maintenance, inventory management, vehicle tracking and monitoring of the sterilization of surgical tools. This technology is widespread in different sectors such as, healthcare, defense, animal, personal protective equipment, laundries, construction, aeronautics, energy. Thank you guys, for your attention. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment or contact us at www.axemtech.com contact. Our experts will be happy to answer you. See you soon.